Come on, it's lamb time right now. We're making a Sunday roast. How good, such a nice dish to make. And we've got plenty of helpers to help us out, Cara and Honey, and of course, the ever useful Alice as well. But I'm running the show here. I've got the big piece of meat in front of me. Let's take it on. While I take it on, with the help, of course, of Cara, Honey and Alice, I need you to make the marinade, OK? You've got all the things you need there. You've got the garlic, you've got the rosemary, and you've got the lemon zest and some olive oil, salt and pepper. You take care of the rest, OK? While you're doing that, we're heading over here to this big yeah. chunk of meat. Can you count out the amount of garlic pieces I've got there? Because I need to make a hole for those pieces. Eight. Eight. One, two, three. Oh, very ginger. Four, five, six, seven. Anywhere else I should stab one, do you think? There, yeah, good, 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 good. Yeah, always yeah. need help. Now, just pop the uh, pop the garlic in there. Maybe Thank even you. pop it in with some of the old rosemary as yeah. well. Allow me to demonstrate because it is quite the technique. Shove it in. Done. <laughs> there you go. Easy, right? You can do that, Curry. Take it away. How are you girls going on the zesting over there? We're going very well. We've uh, got some garlic Shut being grated. Right I'm just right squishing this lemon to get a bit more of that juice out. And I'm going to start zesting that myself. I'm going to pop some potatoes in there as well. While we do that, we've got some spuds ready to go in there. They've been washed. A bit of olive oil over the top, a bit of rosemary. Oh, in they go. Oh, yeah. Oh, yeah. Good. Look at that. Mm. Very good. Brilliant. Nice and moist there. Very good. Nice. And this is just going to go over the top. And with a piece of meat like that, it's about a kilogram and a half. Probably working with about 30 minutes per 500 grams. So half an hour for 500 grams. So we've got 1.5 grams there. And we're going to get that set. Oh, whoa. <laughs> it's quite heavy. Uh, so we're going to get that set. We're ready for the marinade. All right, we're just going to pop a bit of olive oil. Do you want to do the, the honours there, honey? We could add some honey in there too. That'd be nice. <laughs> That'd be nice for a little bit of a glaze. Mmm. Bit of salt in there. I'd love to see what a lot of oil looks like, if some that's pepper. a little bit. <laughs> <laughs> All right. Honey Goodness knows me. that you need lots of oil on top, don't you? Yeah. All right, we're ready to hand it over. Good stuff. There you go. And you could use Thanks, anything, Cara. whatever you've got around there. Girls, I'm going to need you on paintbrush uh, duties here. Get, yeah. uh, get creating, <laughs> get painting. I just need you to paint around there with your thing. Oh, but before I do, actually, got to, in the interest of hygiene, we've touched uh, some meat there, so let's wash our hands really quickly. You ain't touching any meat. You're OK, honey, no <laughs> fooling you. You can start with the old, the old paint work. There you go, bring it a bit closer to you. Get painting over the top. Nice. It's not the Sistine Chapel here. We can just uh, go nice and quickly. There we mm. go. Painting away. Slap nice. You want some of that oil to fall down there and marinate those potatoes as well. Ooh, yum. Nice. I can smell that already. Great. And if you don't have one of these, you can just use a paintbrush, but just make sure you <laughs> have got the paint off first, <laughs> obviously. <laughs> just, just joking, obviously. <laughs> How's, how's that looking, girls? Happy? Or can we use some more marinade on there? More. No. Yeah. yeah. What about this? This looks, it looks a little lonely around this side. Yeah. What about there? yeah. I reckon we can slap the rest of that around the potatoes. What do you think? Around the potatoes? Yeah. Up yeah. to the girls. They're, they're running this one. What do you think, girls? Get it in there, Cara. <laughs> Where do I yeah, put it? Yeah, just tip it on. Use your hands. Brilliant. Yeah. That's going to drip off anyway. Look mm. at that. Isn't that perfection? <laughs> yeah. I've preheated the oven, got that on the right temperature. All the specifics are on the website. I can't really remember them. Someone else <laughs> <laughs> can be in charge of the recipe. And now, girls, it goes in the old oven. Bit of a grown-up duty, this one, the old oven. There we go, a bit of limbo in there. <laughs> and, oh, just as well, there's one I prepared earlier. What do you know, girls? <laughs> this is hot, so standing back, please. Clear the air out, clear the air out. Nice, fantastic, fantastic. There we go on top. And I'll just pop this one in because we've all got to eat. Yes. We've all got to eat. This is just the for the girls. Whole cast and crew. <laughs> there we go, going in there. You can see the blood going down. Beautiful Staff stuff. Meal. This one's not for the vegetarians, obviously, but anyone else will really enjoy it. Coming across, this has got to let this sit for a while, girls, to let the flavours really soak into that meat. Now, look, there's just something I banged up before. Delicious. So we're going to plate that Where up as well. Gorgeous. Oh, it's very light. I thought it was going to be heavy. It's, <laughs> like it's not heavy at all. Okay. <laughs> yes, plastic. Cutting corners here. But uh, anyway, not to worry. Let's pop the old uh, pop the old roast on there. Oh. And it's heavy. Oh, yeah. That is heavy. Can you use two pairs of tongs, maybe? No? There we go. Look at that strength. Nice. Bicep Look at strength. That. Isn't that looking fantastic? Should we throw the potatoes on there as well? Yes. Yeah, I thought you might say Definitely. that. Definitely. Alice, I'll get you on the uh, removal duty. Stand back, girl. Stand back. Hot, hot, hot. Hot, Very hot. Very good. good stuff. <laughs> nice work. So we've got the potatoes going on there. You can unscoop the potatoes. Being careful, though. Be very careful. That is hot. Be sensible when you're around Ooh. hot things in the kitchen, obviously. Mm -hmm. Nice. I like the crane technique there as well. Very, very careful. Do you want to crane a few in, honey? Sure. Nice. Yum. 
being careful of it. It's a hot pot. Get that crane working for you. <laughs> nice. Good stuff. Look at the colour on those potatoes. It is good. And you know what? This Do you, do you reckon we chuck this in the bin, the leftover stuff? What no. Reckon, Cara? What might we do with it? Put it over the um, meat. Yeah, put it over the meat. But, you know, you can make it even more tasty, I suppose. You can even savour it that little bit further. If you add some flour to make, you might have heard of the term gravy. Oh, uh, yeah. Nice. And we've just got some stock here as well, of course. Something I prepared earlier. Uh, a cup, it would seem, of stock. Honey, get stocky. Put it in there. <laughs> and, of and course, while I do this, I'm going to get the stove going just to warm it up a little bit. But right. before we do that, we've got to mix it all in together. Put the spoon to good use, Cara. Mix it all in together. Any ideas what we might be doing here, Alice? What are we What are we looking to do when we're mixing this all together with well, the flour? Well, we're, we're making sure that the flour dissolves into the stock and we're creating kind of like a jus or a gravy. Um, the flour helps to thicken up that sauce, right? Yeah. Yeah. You know all about flour, don't you, honey? Yes. <laughs> I reckon that's ready to go yeah. on the stove. Yeah, ready to go on the stove. Oh, the hot pot. Yeah, hot pot, hot pot, hot jambalaya. Hold it on there. Good, right. good. And now we just reduce this, we get it going. It's going to take way too long, so we're not going to do that, of course. But I have actually got one that I prepared earlier, which comes in handy. All this preparing earlier, if I could do this at home, I'd always cook. Unfortunately, you've got to do it in real time at home. And this is the gravy. You can see the difference in consistency there, girls. Mm. Yeah. It's much thicker. Yeah, yeah I'm about to... Sh there we go. We could pour that over the lamp, but there you go. What, how, what does that look like? Any guesses, Carl? Gravy. It does. Fantastic. What a relief. It is in fact gravy. <laughs> Good stuff. Do you like gravy on your lamp? Yeah. Well, then get pouring, Carl. Right. <laughs> and we're going to pour it. Oh, is this coming across there? We're going to pour our way into the break and then we're going to get snacking. Whoa. Recipe on the website. Get on there. Enjoy. Great.